The decline of North America's manufacturing sector has long played a central role in shaping the region's economy and politics. Largely a byproduct of free trade policies and less regulated foreign labor and environmental markets, North America's offshoring led to a loss of well-paying manufacturing jobs and much of the foundation of the middle class. Silicon metal production, an element crucial to the modern digital economy and the ongoing renewable energy revolution, was no different and is now primarily based overseas. An unfortunate side effect of this industry offshoring has been a marked increase in the pollution associated with manufacturing. Many countries favored by free trade policies, such as China, India, Indonesia, and Malaysia, primarily rely on dirty energy sources like coal and exhibit more lax regulatory environments, enabling significant residual discharges. China, by far, is the largest silicon metal producer in the world, with no other nation even coming close. In 2021, the country produced 6 million metric tons of silicon, with the next most significant producer, Russia, coming in at just 580,000 metric tons. This means many technologies being used to fuel the global economy and to stimulate renewable energy and other clean tech industries are underpinned by unnecessarily dirty silicon metal. This provides an opportunity for North America to regain its former manufacturing prowess, especially as ESG compliance and environmental reporting increasingly become mandatory. To do this, North America needs to harness a new competitive edge that aligns with other industrial and government objectives, like improving operational efficiency, fighting climate change, and adhering to sustainability commitments. There's no sense in luring dirty operations back to North America, as necessary exemptions to regulatory compliance would be contrary to other societal objectives. For silicon metal producers, this new competitive edge lies in the PureVap Quartz Reduction Reactor, or QRR. This breakthrough technology can dramatically shake up the silicon status quo, 